good morning i'm not sure it is still morning but i thought i'd start out here this is my front porch um this is the best place i can get as much light as possible for my dendrobium in the winter months where it was indoors was the back of the house which is north facing um, this is south facing and as you can see in here i mean i can't actually see what i'm doing because it's so sunny all i've got is the reflection of the glass behind me um so i put him out here yesterday just to see how it's done it's frost proof i mean obviously i can ventilate it because there you go the door's open um and you know that's what it's like outside today it's all nice and sunny and beautiful out there today um but the best I can do is in here. Um, the disadvantage is it hasn't got the humidity it needs. So down here on the floor is a bowl of water just to see if we can hire the humidity. So I'm going to have a play around. But at the minute, it's nice and warm out of here. It's about 27 in here at the minute. So um, at the minute, it's as warm as it's going to get really because it's 10 to 12. So it's not likely to get much warmer than this now and it as it goes past midday obviously it's going to go down um so okay i watered him this morning so he's all been watered and sorted just to see if i could get the humidity up a bit but i'm not sure i'm going to manage that okay right i have just watered this lot and sorted them out and i don't know if you can see if you look around there and up here I don't know if I can look, there it is. That snake's head or the flower spike has managed to work its way around the back towards the window. So I've just watered these. It's Sunday morning. Well, it's not, it's Sunday afternoon actually because I've just had so much stuff going on this week. I haven't had time to do anything else. Um, so these are a little bit late, but you know, we're there. I can't see any flower spike on this one yet. This one is looking as good as ever. It's just going to stay like that. Now you might notice the leaves are a lot cleaner. That's because I've just cleaned them with the lemon juice. Um, these guys are producing leaves. Whether they're going to produce spikes or not this year is anybody's guess. Um, so there you go. The reason I'm out of breath is because I've just run up the stairs. Um, <laughs> right, okay. So there are my five um, orchids on the windowsill up here. Okay. Hi, right, welcome back. There's, this is my number six, I think it is. I can't remember off the top of my head and I can't see the number on it. Um, but the one of these buds has just started to open today um, it's facing this window here so this window is facing that way so it's obviously getting to the light there so that's there it's opening a bit peculiar but you know and there's the other bud there on the end um, the only other thing I can see on here is again there's the uh, the spike, the other spike there that's coming off of there. There you go, it is very, very slowly, gradually growing up. Number two, this one doesn't appear to have changed. I have watered it. I've had to go with the paper towel just to see what that does. If anything, it will kill it, it will do something, or it will grow roots. I'm not quite sure. Um, I've had a look at this one. I can't find in any shape or form any kind of spike thing, but you can see the roots are doing wonderful stuff. And I have cleaned the leaves on there as well. Um, obviously, I've watered these. There's nothing much there to say. But have a look at this. You know what I said about my Thanksgiving cactus, particularly my pink one. Look at this. And I'm not kidding, there are more buds on there to open. It is absolutely smothered. Um, 
this one is absolutely smothered. I don't know if you can see just there. Look, on the left there, there's a bud at the top there of the red one, and this one coming out this side. Uh, basically, I've just watered this lot. I've had a colour of the stuff that's not working and the stuff that is. Um, this triffid to my right is trying to get into everywhere because <laughs> it's huge, this spider plant. Um, obviously, there's my birthday plant. I bought myself with some money that I was actually given. Um, basically there's nothing very exciting going on at the moment. The only thing that I'm trying out at the minute is to see whether the dendrobium will actually do better out in the porch because it's south facing and obviously it gets the sun a lot of the day but where it's hanging it's actually not in the direct sunlight. Um, so we're just going to try that and see what happens. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. And I do apologise for this being a bit late, but I have been so busy. It's just been ridiculous. Um, that you'll keep your eye out for an extra video, which may appear in the middle of next week. Don't know, there's a nice surprise coming in, and that's a birthday present to myself, from myself. Because I felt like it. Okay, so I will see you next week. Goodbye. Bye-bye.